This is sleepwalker arms or zombie arms. It's great for integrating into the shoulders, the arm bone into the shoulders. And in this pose, uh, we'll lengthen the side body first. So you'll inhale and fill yourself up. It's an expansion in the rib cage and the shoulders come back, reach your arms straight out. So in sleep rocker arms, the arms extend forward and then we draw them back to the sweet spot in the shoulders. Here's what I mean by the sweet spot. This is arm bones not integrated in the shoulder uh, girdle. You'll feel the shoulder blades off the back or not towards the spine. And then I can sort of jam them back, and this is not the sweet spot either. We don't want either of these positions. But you'll inhale, extend forward, and then with straight arms, draw the arm bones back. Shoulder blades will be flat on your back. That's the exercise. We'll take it to three other positions. This is developing awareness of how the arm bone articulates with the shoulder joint. On hands and knees, same idea. I'll inhale and lengthen the side body. And then if I press out through my arms, the shoulder blades slide off the back. It's a good stretch for the upper back, but you don't wanna do much weight-bearing movement from this position. Instead, you wanna take the arm bones, I'm softening the upper back until the shoulder blades come flat on the back. Here's too much. Here's stretching out and coming to the neutral arm bones on the back. Here it is on the back, a different position. Again, developing awareness of how the arm bone articulates with the shoulder blades is the purpose of this exercise. It'll help us in all our other ones. Here I reach up. Notice the arm bone is not integrated fully in the shoulder girdle. The shoulder blade slides away from the spine. And with an exhale, straight arms, take the arm bone straight down, even press down and lift the heart up. This is arm bone articulating with the shoulder blade as it should. Here it is again. This is it's just stretching the back. Here's integration. Keep this integration and slowly take your arms overhead. Notice I haven't bent the elbows, reaching up integrate the arm bones. You actually feel the upper shoulders press into the floor. Keep that and take your arms overhead. Maybe you have to pause here. That's fine. It's better to pause here than to go out of alignment. Take a block and just palm it between your hands and you'll reach up. Exhale, come back, even press the shoulders, lift the heart. Even press the shoulders into the floor and get one shoulder blade underneath you, then the other. And slowly take your arms overhead, open throat, elbows straight. I'm starting to get a little stretch right here, intensity in the pose. One more time, shoulder blade more towards the spine, arm bones overhead, open your throat. Breathe here. And to come out of the pose, lift your arm bones up and release.